our teachers are very committed to teach us on various lessons. So call every child to come and listen to us. It is every day, visit our YouTube at PCA Naivasha Town and we are going to work together in this Brigade Week. God bless you and be with you. Amen. Praise God, children. Um, it is me again, your teacher. Uh, my name is Esther and I hope you remember me. I'm your secretary. I miss you so much. And today, I'm here um, to teach you several things. As you all, um, I know you know that our theme is about being good vessels of the Lord. And in the Bible, you have seen so many examples of being good vessels in the Lord. Uh, as I begin, I'm going to tell you the story of David. I know we all know David. He was a king. And as you remember, he was anointed by Samuel. Yes. So as I begin, I'm going to tell you that uh, as kids, many people may look down upon us because we are kids. They think that we do not know things. I am telling you, as you can see, David was the last born of Samuel, and he was chosen by, uh, was, a, was the last born of Jesse, and he was chosen by Samuel to be the king. So I am telling you that we should not uh, be disappointed or anything because um, even though we are children, God has uh, good things for us all as long as we, we we decide to be good vessels of the Lord, we follow our parents, we obey our parents, we do what we do what um, our parents tell us just as David did. He was looking after the sheep of his parents, so and he was doing it willingly, without any difficulty or without complaining or anything. So as we emulate David as a good vessel, should always do what our parents tell us. Do not do it um, with a good, with a bad heart. You should do it openly um, by either washing uh, your utensils or after you eat, you take your utensils back to the sink. You you make sure you do your homework. I know right now we are at home. You are studying online. Make sure you have done your homework. You do whatever your teachers tell you. You do you do as you are supposed to do, because we also know as the story of Jonah tells us. You remember, um, God had chosen Jonah to go to Nineveh and to preach about the Holy Spirit, but Jonah decided not to go, and we also know that he was swallowed by a fish. So if you also disrespect your parents, something bad will definitely happen to you. And you also because you are good children and you do not want anything bad to happen to you, make sure you obey your parents, make sure you spread your bed in the morning, make sure you also brush your teeth in the morning, make sure you do everything that you're supposed to do. Because if you disrespect your parents, they're not being good vessels. And you know if you're not a good vessel, something bad might happen to you. And if also if you disrespect your parents, you should also ask for forgiveness. Because as we have also seen, even though Jonah disobeyed and he was followed by the fish for three days, he was also um, he also accepted the calling and he went to Nineveh and preached. So from the story of Jonah, it teaches us that even though we disobey our parents and we do bad things that you're not supposed to do, God is always there. He will always forgive you and will always give you a second chance to do what you're supposed to do. So as a good vessel of God, make sure you obey God's word, you obey your parents. You do not look down upon other people. You be good to your friends. You be good to your brother and sister. Should also, as the other teachers have taught us so many things, should also to adhere to whatever our teachers have taught us. And as we do that, we'll be good vessels of the Lord and everything will be good to us. And even during this pandemic, now we are not going to school and we also not coming to church. Make sure you pray every day. Make sure you pray with your parents, even when your parents do not pray. Make sure you call them to the sitting room or whatever place and you make sure you also pray with them. Make sure you also do whatever the government is telling us so that um, everything will be good uh, once the pandemic is over. So as good vessels, our teaching today is that we should always be respectful and obey our parents and read the Bible and make sure we pray every day and everything is going to be okay. We should also continue being good kids and being good vessels of the Lord and 
I end here and you also greet your parents and tell them we love you so much. You have a good holiday at home even though I know some of you are bored and want to go to school. But have a good day and God will bless you. Bye. Love you so much.